Every baby deserves a healthy start and they're given that opportunity here in Monroe County through an organization known as the Florida Keys Healthy Start Coalition. This organization offers free services to women intended to help those women and their families bring healthy babies into the community. They have a couple upcoming events that you don't want to miss out on. We'll talk about those this morning along with just hearing more about this incredible organization. Leah, thank you so much for being here. Good morning. Here. Thank you for having me. Well, first of all, congratulations on 20 years. You're yes. celebrating your 20-year anniversary. Yes, so. the Healthy Start Coalition has been around for um, 20 years now, helping families uh, before, during, and after pregnancy. And it's a, it's a wonderful thing. We're actually now starting to see some second generation. We helped their families, and now they're starting their own families. And um, it's a wonderful service in the community we're I'm um, very proud to help these families. We're the only organization specifically helping families during, specifically during pregnancy, and we're very glad um, that we're able to help them bring healthy babies into the world. Leah, what are some of the programs that you offer through the Healthy Start Coalition? Mm -hmm. um, we have several main programs. Uh, there are roughly 700 babies born in Monroe County every year, and we help about 75% of families through our Healthy Babies program, which is a program that um, provides subsidized funding for women that do not have insurance so that they're able to obtain prenatal care, which is obviously essential to the health of um, a mom and her unborn child. We have a child safety program where we help families um, with car seat safety, water safety, that's a um, very important program that we are the only ones in Monroe County that offer that. And so we actually go beyond our scope of just moms and babies, and we, we serve all children uh, mm -hmm. with that program. We have an advocacy and education where we reach out to the community at large, um, and not just people that are currently pregnant. 50% uh, of pregnancies are unplanned. Mm -hmm. So we really like to reach out to any women um, in the community of childbearing age and let them know about the services that we're able to offer. Um, and so those are a few, and we also have our Healthy Start program, which is uh, in partnership with the Monroe County Health Department, and they work directly with um, clients who are pregnant or who have a child. Um, we serve zero through age three, and our services are based on need, um, not on financial need. And so we, and we're open to anyone, anyone who is pregnant, thinking about becoming pregnant, has a young child, um, we're able to help them. We, through the Healthy Start program, have breastfeeding assistance, childbirth education, um, mm -hmm. resources to help quit smoking, referrals to other programs, basically whatever they need to make sure the mom is healthy and the baby is healthy, um, we're able to help with that. This is so awesome. I mean, it's, it really, these are services that, that so many women need mm -hmm. for healthy babies. Yep. They say that um, for every dollar spent on services before a baby is born, prenatal care, it saves $6 in the cost um, to society over the baby's childhood of in, if they had not had that um, prenatal care and the resources they needed before in medical costs and other cost other social services and um, that sort of thing. So really it's it's money well invested and, and it pays off um, in the long term for sure. Absolutely. Now Leah, let's say there's a woman out there who's pregnant right now. Mm -hmm. She wants to use your services. Mm -hmm. What does she need to do the first step? Um, there are several ways you can become involved in our program. She can pick up the phone and call us. Our, 305-293-8424 is our phone number. Also, um, it's required by law that when a woman goes to her first um, doctor's appointment, when she first finds out she's pregnant, she fills out something called a prenatal risk screen. And it's just a short questionnaire she fills out and it helps identify women that would be um, particularly in need of our services. And those the doctors then submit to us and we can um, have clients referred to the program. We have other agencies that we work very closely with that we'll call and refer. Mm -hmm. um, so basically any, any way, um, and our community is so small, mm -hmm. you, 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 we get clients often even before the doctors do. Mm -hmm. You're pregnant, you call Healthy Start. It's kind <laughs> of a known, or we're hoping it's a known um, thing in the community. And we also have bilingual staff. So we're able to help um, with Creole um, speaking and Spanish speaking uh, clients as well. Great. So it's simple to get started with oh, you. Oh, yep, definitely. Mm -hmm. Okay, Leah, you have a couple of events coming up that mm -hmm. people in the community can go to and help support 
your yep. organization? Um, we have a big fundraiser coming up this week, and this helps support our programs year-round for families. Uh, it's at the Bottle Cap on Friday night, May 10th, and it will um, have a silent auction, a 50-50 raffle. We also have a chance, since it's Mother's Day weekend, mm -hmm. anyone out there that forgot to buy their Mother's Day gifts, we will have local businesses there that are um, willing to help us uh, raise money by selling their products and donating the proceeds to Healthy Start. Mm -hmm. um, we have two raffles that we are selling tickets for. We only have 250 tickets for sale of each, so pretty good odds. And mm -hmm. one is for a fabulous vacation package. Mm -hmm. The other is for a pamper yourself, spas and um, wellness and pedicures, that sort of thing. Um, tickets are $20 for those. They'll be sold all week or mm -hmm. at the event if we have any left. Hopefully, mm -hmm. I'm hoping <laughs> we don't have any left by the event, but if somebody comes to the event, we will have those for sale. Um, and if you are present, if you have the winning ticket and you're present when the drawing um, is held that night, there's an additional cash prize. Wonderful. Yeah, so those are two great ways that we're trying to, you know, raise some money to to continue our um, level of services and, and help families. Wonderful. I hope you have another 20 successful years. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Leah, thank you very much. Thank you for being on this thank morning. Thank you. All right, I'm going to take a quick break right now, but I'll be right back after this commercial break, so stay with me. There's more to come.